So you might be in a position where you're trying to figure out if you have a virus on your iPhone. Now, I'm going to be completely honest, you probably do not have any sort of virus on your iPhone at all, and viruses are very hard to come by on an iPhone like this. So if it, as long as it's supported with software, and as long as you're kind of up to date with software, you probably do not have a virus, so keep that in mind. However, there are times where you might see a random little pop-up that comes up that looks something along the lines of like something like this, where it shows that, oh my goodness, there's like a virus on your phone and it's like severely going to damage your iPhone and all this other stuff. And there's a lots of little scam things that come up like this. So if you have like one of those things that pop up on your iPhone, funny enough, here's like my old video I did last year about the same thing. In order for you to actually see if you have a virus on your iPhone, you have to have been doing something crazy. So these types of pop-ups don't mean anything. Keep that in mind. But the quick way to go ahead and, you know, kind of, but another way to go ahead and tell if you have a virus is to see if you've recently done anything crazy on your phone, meaning did you jailbreak your iPhone? Did you install some weird third-party applications? If, though, if that ends up being the case, well, all you're going to have to do here, there's only one way to fix it. It's by resetting your iPhone. But before we start that, again, make sure that, you know, if you have just some weird pop-ups that look like this, or people are messaging you and it's like, a scam thing you can block those scammers but most of the time you do not have a virus 99.99 percent of people watching this you do not have a virus but if you installed a weird third-party app from a really weird website or you jailbreak your iphone you could do one of two things one you can try updating your iphone so go and make way over to your settings of your iphone i don't know what's going on here and why my settings is not opening so make your way over to your settings and then what you want to do is click on general and go and click on software update and install the latest update available for your phone that is the first thing I'd recommend doing. Now, for some reason that doesn't work or you don't have an update available, the only other thing you're going to have to do is to reset your iPhone. So back up all of the data that you can, send yourself all your photos and videos, everything that you can, click on transfer reset iPhone, click on erase all content and settings, and basically erase all the content and settings from your iPhone. That is really the only other option you have here. So that kind of covers it up for the most part. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, not me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.